Okay, this is MAT0024, Final Exam Review, by Pola Summers, as far as working out the problems. Okay, let's see, the first problem is an order of operations problem. We're supposed to simplify this. So looking at this, there's division, multiplying, and subtraction. Most of you have learned, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. We don't have parentheses here. We don't have exponents. So we multiply or divide working left to right. Negative 18 divided by 3 then is where we start. That's a negative 6 times 2 minus 7. We're still on multiply and divide. Whatever comes first, left to right. Next is negative 6 times 2, negative 12, subtract 7, and negative 12 minus 7 is negative 19. So that's our first answer. For the second problem, we have a 2 and then a bracket, 5 plus 2 on the outside of 3 minus 8, all in the bracket. So again, Leaning on our please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, we first go in the innermost parentheses, which is right here, and do the problem 3 minus 8, which is a negative 5, and then leave everything else alone. And it's worthwhile just to go ahead and write it all down again. Still working in the innermost parentheses, or now that this is completed, we back off to the bracket and we have 5 plus 2 times negative 5. So we have to multiply before we can add. So we go ahead and multiply 2 times negative 5 and get negative 10. And in the bracket, we have now 5 plus the negative 10. So you just keep copying everything else down and just focus on where the order of operations is directing us. So now we're going to take care of 5 plus negative 10, negative 5, inside the bracket. We have a 2 outside. When there isn't an operation written, it's an implied multiply. So 2 times negative 5, negative 10 is the answer to our second problem.